Hey everybody, Nomadic Matt here again. A lot of people always ask me, what should they pack for their trip? What do I pack for my trip? Well this week, we're gonna talk about it. There is one universal principle you should follow. It's pack light. I can tell you from lots and lots of experience, you will only need about half the stuff you take. When you start packing, simply throw everything in there, and then remove half of it. So what do I pack? Absolutely nothing. I go stark naked. No, 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 I, that would scare everybody. I actually take a bunch of stuff. And here's what I take. Clothing. Take something to put over your legs. A pair of jeans, a pair of shorts, a bathing suit. I don't really care. A bunch of underwear because you don't want to have dirty underwear. I take a dress shirt because sometimes I like to look nice when I'm going out. I like to feel pretty. I take about four or five t-shirts. I wear them for a few days and when I run out, I just do laundry. A long sleeve shirt for when it gets cold. And then I take about 12 pairs of socks. Now you're probably thinking, why so many socks? Gremlins steal them. I don't know where they go. Every time I go traveling, I take four pairs, I lose them all. I finally decided to overpack of socks. One towel, always take a towel. And then I take sneakers for everyday use, flip flops for beaches and other occasions, and a pair of dress shoes for when I wanna go out and look nice. Toiletries. With toiletries, you really only need the basics. I take a tube of toothpaste, a toothbrush, dental floss because my dentist would yell at me otherwise, shampoo, soap and I take liquid soap because bars of soap get all grimy and icky and you just don't want to deal with that. Hair gel because I like my hair to look nice and if I don't gel it down it throws out like this. A comb, a razor, and deodorant. You really don't want to be that smelly backpacker, right? I mean people like when people smell nice. Don't be that guy because if you're that guy in front of me I'm gonna take out my deodorant and I'm just gonna deodorant all over your face. Don't smell. Next, I take a small med kit. Scrapes and cuts do happen. So, I take Band-Aids, Neosporin, cortisone cream, take Tylenol in case I got a headache, Pepto-Bismol because sometimes food doesn't really settle in your stomach and you really don't want to spend your whole trip on a toilet. Hand sanitizer because germs are everywhere. And that's really it. Again, we're following the principle here. Pack light. Travel gear. Now as a blogger, as a guy that likes video, of course, I take a bunch of gear with me. Gear you probably don't really need, but here's what comes with me. A video camera so I can make these amazing lovely videos that you see every Wednesday. An iPhone so I can stay in touch with people, listen to music, read my apps. A small point and shoot camera. I take a laptop so I can blog. So that's really all I take for gear. And then finally, there's all those miscellaneous things. These are sort of the random things that you don't really think about, but you'll need. Earplugs, if you're sleeping in dorms, someone's gonna snore. Or maybe you're on a long bus and people are being loud. Earplugs are a godsend. Ziploc bags, things leak and it's always good to have a small little Ziploc bag. Plastic bags, I use this to throw in my shoes so they don't dirty up my clothes. And I throw laundry in them too. A lock because you're going to want to lock your stuff up while you're out sightseeing and going out drinking and you don't want to worry like, oh my god, someone's going to steal my passport. Locks will keep you at ease. And I like to have a small little thing of duct tape because maybe your bag gets ripped, maybe something's leaking. Duct tape solves all the problems. You never know where you're going to need duct tape. So that's it. That is what I take when I travel. I don't really take much stuff. Sometimes I even feel with that list, I'm taking more than I need, but this list works for me. So until next time, travel safe, travel wide, travel often. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get great videos every Wednesday. See you next Wednesday.